We've been talking about laundry room solutions, and we've got another great one for you as we finish up this hour. Now, this is a big one, literally, from Singer. And what it, it's called the electric steam press. Now, typically, this is something that you might think of in more of a professional environment. The reason you love it, it's become a customer pick, the reason you've let us know that you love it is because, first off, it's easy to use. It, you can press out, whether it's your clothes, your draperies, your tables, tablecloths in no time because the size of this is almost 14 times larger than a conventional iron, which means you're doing your, those jobs very, very quickly. Now, we've got it for you on five flex payments of $39.99, and you can read the reviews on hsn.com. But we're joined this morning by Stephanie Rance, and she is um, a, a great lifestyle uh, and do DIY expert. She also is a host of her own blog, a host of things. And we are glad that Stephanie <laughs> Rance is joining us. Thank you so much. I good see morning. The steam. Good morning. I know. Oh, I love it. It's such a good feeling. It's such a nice warm <laughs> feeling. So this is the Singer Steam Press, and it is so wonderful. From everything in your wardrobe closet mm. to your linen closet and even your craft closet, you're going to be able to get professional results. I am going through one, two, three, four layers of denim right now. Wow. I'm closing it with a clamshell design, and look at that. Yeah. Professional results here in the steamed area and also here on the edges mm -hmm. where it gives you a nice crisp edge. Look at that. Look at that. In no time. In no time. That yeah. was just seconds. And we went through four layers of denim. So it can really blast through the thicker fabrics when you need it to. And it'll also go through delicate things as well. Okay. And we're going to show you these. And, why, and I really want you to kind of keep track of what Stephanie is doing so that you'll see. Wait a minute. This is real simple to use. Yes, absolutely. So let me give you a tour of the machine. So this is the Singer Steam Press. Singer's been around for over 160 years. So they're making really wonderful products um, in conjunction with their sewing machines. Also something that works well with fabric. So this is a clamshell design. All you're going to do is you're going to close the clamshell after you give it some nice bursts of steam there. Mm -hmm. Close it, press your fabric, and then lift it up after a few seconds. Okay. It's a 24 inch by nine inch surface. And just like you said, that's 14 times larger right here than a traditional iron. So that's seven here on the bottom wow. times two is 40 is uh, 14 yeah. and then we also have 49 steam vents up at the top so that's where all that steam is blasting through like oh crazy isn't that amazing yeah so when you're ready to actually press something I'll show you how okay. now take this delicate piece it has sequins on it and uh, you know it could be beading anything else that's very delicate maybe mm -hmm. some heirloom pieces that you just kind of want to be careful with yeah. no problem really you just push the extra fabric to the back. You'll okay. notice that this is a very large, wide hinge for uh -huh. that purpose. We will blast that steam. Woohoo! <laughs> and I'm press oh it down for just a couple seconds and lift it up. And then you can pull the rest of the fabric down. Now the heat um, options here, all you're going to do is close your um, clamshell and you can pick between nylon, silk, wool, cotton, and linen. Okay. And there's also after your machine is cooled down, there's a locking mechanism there too. Okay, so that you can keep it closed yeah. and, and keep it nice and safe and secure. And that's a good idea as well. But do you notice how literally, now Stephanie is kind of going slow showing us how to do this, but if she were really doing this, you know, doing her laundry, she would have been done with this shirt and on to like two more since then. Absolutely. And even the sequence you were able to do. Could you imagine doing this with a regular iron? No. You would burn all of those, they would melt, and you would be, you know, it would be a ruined shirt. That's right because you're not putting direct heat like a hot metal iron plate on that sequence. Correct, correct, <laughs> exactly. And you know, they don't make irons that are that small. <laughs> so you would really have to work your way in there. So now I'm gonna do a full men's shirt and okay. I'm gonna do this in just a few seconds. Okay. So all you do is push that excess to the back yeah. and then you can maneuver your way around the shirt. And sometimes shirts just need a little freshening up, right? Yeah. They don't necessarily need to be taken to the dry cleaner where you have to pay six, seven dollars a shirt. Yeah. You just need a little freshening up. My husband had this on the floor. Mm -hmm. You know, he just decided he didn't want to wear it. But is it dirty? No. no. <laughs> yeah. So instead of me having to do more laundry, yeah. I'm just going to give it a little freshening up and then right. he can wear it again. And do you see how fast this is? I mean, it really is. This is what they do when you take something to the dry cleaners. Yes. Except the difference is you have to do it on their time. You have to deliver the clothes to them. You have to wait for them to get them back to you. You're paying per garment 
or you can have it at home and you can do it whenever you need to. Absolutely. And that's the deal. And that's why these are customer picks. And it's because it gives you professional quality at home. And it's from Singer, a brand that you know and trust, particularly when it comes to our clothes and our fabrics, because we've been making our own clothes with Singer for years. Yes, absolutely. So they know that this machine is going to work with those heavier duty fabrics. And then also with the delicate ones as well. So now I'm going to be doing the sleeve. If you notice here on the front, this is a tapered end, and at this end, it is more square. Okay. So that you can use that to your advantage when you're doing different articles of clothing. I'm doing a sleeve here now. And this is what you would do if you're going to use a long sleeve as well. So this is a short sleeve or a long sleeve. You can just angle it right here on the edge, mm -hmm. press down, and lift it up. And look at that. Isn't that impressive? Oh, very nice. <laughs> Very, Very good. nice. And and I see that a lot of you are calling in for these just to just to let you know we only have a couple hundred and then that's it. And hopefully we'll get some back in. Um, but but if we do, I don't know how long that's going to take. I know that we've got these right now. And this is one that we wanted to feature in this hour of laundry room solutions because this is a big one. And if you're the one who does the ironing and the pressing for your family, mm -hmm. for their regular everyday clothes, for their uniforms, for, right. you know, whether it's the kids' uniforms, the, the work uniforms, whatever the case is, you want something that you can kind of get through as quickly as possible. Yes, uniforms is a great point. If you are someone who was in the military or is ser currently serving, thank you very much. And um, my father-in-law is a retired um, military uh, officer as well. And so he, even though he's retired, he really wants his polos to look fantastic right, <laughs> right. now still. Right. So he bought this as well and he enjoys it so much. He even has a perfect little uh, stand for it to go on. Oh, nice. So this is perfect for baby clothes too. Mm -hmm. Baby clothes are something that we don't iron very often because we just don't have the time, right? <laughs> but if you have something like this and you can blast through all those little tiny crevices and things like that and that'll look really perfect and professional. That's right. These look so good. And everything that you've done from the jeans, to the linen, to the cotton, to the sequins. Have you noticed that Stephanie has done all of these different kinds of materials and every single one comes out looking like a professional job? Yes, indeed. And now we're gonna move on to our tabletop. So okay. how about that linen closet? We would really like to press all those large pieces like our tablecloths, our yeah. table runners, which can take a lot of time and yes. a lot of energy. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna actually do some napkins as well. So you can use this as a creaser to make beautiful yeah. napkin, yeah, uh, napkin folding as well. So I'm just gonna press that down. Okay. And I also wanna mention, you can use this without the steam. So if you have something that you don't wanna steam, um, which I'll get to in the crafting section, mm -hmm. then yeah, you don't have to. You just leave um, the steam button, uh, you know, don't press the steam buttons up here on the top. Right. And we're just going to close this and make those nice crisp edges. Be perfect for a wedding or oh. if you cater. Oh, wow, yeah. Beautiful, right? Look at... Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> I love, I hope you're getting ideas for how you're gonna use this when you get it home. And oh, perfect. So this is how they do it in the hotels. That's how they do it. <laughs> my gosh. Exactly. Or the hotels or the restaurants that charge you a whole lot of money, you know, because they do this. <laughs> you can do it. And that's what makes this exciting. This is a spring price. We took $50 off of the regular HSN price. It became a customer pick when it was $50 more. But you're getting the spring price. You're getting the exact same unit. You get all of the accessories, including your water, um, you know, your water uh, spout so that you can, because it seems, so you want to be able to put the water in and then you also get your spray bottle that comes right along with it as well as the unit itself. So everything comes included except that it's minus $50 because we already took that care of that. And you even have free shipping to get this home. So if you're saying, okay, I'm going to use it for particularly your home decor. Mm -hmm. It would make a world of difference. Look at this. And so now you've got, is that a, is that a um, pillowcase? Pillowcase. Yeah. It's a large pillowcase. We just blasted right through it. I mean, when would you ever want to really do your pillowcases otherwise? Yeah. You know, this makes it so easy. And speaking of the water reservoir, I'll show you where that is. Mm -hmm. This holds 300 milliliter, li, milliliters of water right here. And it's not a water guzzler. So we just went through so many items and it's not even empty yet. So you really don't have to fill it as much as you would with a regular iron. Okay. And we're oh. even going to do some tissue paper. Stephanie. Really? Do you, do you know how expensive tissue paper is? <laughs> yeah, that's why I, hold, I keep it. I save it. I know. I do 
too. And so I get it out when I want to reuse it. And some of it's so pretty. So all you have to do oh is just gosh. blast a little steam and then Seriously? you can reuse your tissue paper. Isn't that wonderful? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I told you it was gentle. <laughs> Okay, now I've seen a lot of demonstrations over the 10 years I've been at Agent <laughs> I've never seen anybody iron paper. Right? Basically. <laughs> wow. So now we're going to move on to our craft closet. And if you're a quilter, then you'll definitely love this machine or maybe just a, a sewer in general. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to put my quilting squares down here. I'm Look, I'm, I don't even know how many I have. I'm just mm -hmm. laying them all out and I'm going to steam them mm -hmm. and press them and be done. And okay. then I can move on and start sewing and having fun because that's what's really important. Because if you had to literally hand iron every single one of those squares I mean you'd be you'd be that would take up <laughs> half, your, half your time half it your would. quilting time it would and it kind of uh you know you lose your momentum when you're doing things like that That's versus right. the actual quilting oh, or sewing part so great so speaking of which we're actually going to use the dry setting now and I'm going to put this interfacing on the back of this fabric so I'm just going to need to close it okay. now there's two audible alarms I also want you to know about one is when you close it and leave it down for more than 10 seconds mm -hmm. it will beep which we'll wait for okay. and also if you leave it up there it is you hear that? Uh-huh. And if you leave it up for more than 15 minutes, then it'll go into an automatic cool down. So okay. you have no worries if you happen to be in the, leaving the house in a rush or mm -hmm. something like that. No problem. It has lots of safety features built in. Okay, good, good. And I wanted to ask you too, because, and I, again, I see a lot of you on the phone and you can see our clock is counting down. So as you're watching and as you're getting ideas, um, I do want you to go ahead and order, recognizing that we only have, um, well, about a couple hundred, just fewer than 200 of these now remaining, and then that's it. That's all we have left with everybody who's calling in, with everybody who's ordering. But Stephanie, I wanted to ask you, because you said there are will, will be times where you don't want to use the steam option. Yes. How do I determine if I want to use steam or not? Oh, you know, it just depends on your fabric or what kind of item you're doing. You know, if you're going to be, um, like for example, I'm going to put some iron-on uh, iron on adhesive right here. I cut this out using my Cricut machine. Okay. And so in, for this example, I don't need to use my steam. And so I'll just push it down like this. Mm -hmm. We'll close it. Okay. And um, it'll adhere better if you don't use uh, the steam. If it's dry. Right. That's oh, I, okay, I get it. But mm -hmm. I like that you've got the option there. You have there. the option, yes. So now okay. we're going to lift that up. See wow, if it's enough. Oh, I can't wait to see it. We'll leave it down one more time, which All is right. so easy to do. And, but if you were ironing, mm -hmm. um, you'd have to be really careful not to crinkle it as you iron. Correct. But with this, it's just one pass. Yeah, and you yeah. have to do like pieces at a time, like this little section and this little section if you have a large pattern. But here, you can do the whole design all at once, mm -hmm. and it'll be just completely finished. And it's just beautiful, and you'll love it. Okay. And, and so these are some of the things that you can set. do. Just if a little you, bit longer. Yeah, if you are a crafter, if you are um, somebody who's making home decor items, if you like to sew or quilt or, or anything in that realm, if you like to make sure that your home um, is perfectly decked out. So you've got guests and people coming over and you want to make sure that those napkins are looking amazing. You want to make sure that those pillowcases are nice and crisp. You have the easiest possible way and the quickest possible way. Because remember, this is 14 times larger than the average iron. And